In the past week, we have seen a rapid escalation of cases of COVID-19. More cases and deaths have now been reported in the rest of the world than in China. We have also seen a rapid escalation in social distancing measures like closing school, schools and canceling sporting events and other gatherings. But we have not seen an urgent enough escalation in testing, isolation and contact tracing, which is the backbone of the response. Social distancing measures can help to reduce transmission and enable health systems to cope. Hand washing and coughing into your elbow can reduce the risk of, for, your, for yourself and others. But on their own, they're not enough to extinguish this epidemic. It's the combination that makes the difference. As I keep saying, all countries must take a comprehensive approach. But the most effective way to prevent infections and save lives is breaking the chains of transmission. And to do that, you must test and isolate. You cannot fight a fire blindfolded. And we cannot stop this pandemic if we don't know who is infected. We have a simple message for all countries, test, test, test. Test every suspected case. If they, ha if they test positive, isolate them and find out who they have been in close contact with up to two days before they developed symptoms and test those people too. Every day, more tests are being produced to meet the global demand. WHO has shipped almost 1.5 million tests to 120 countries. We're working with comp companies to increase the availability of tests for those most in need. 